So hello everybody! Today I am sharing with you my makeup collection and in the process I'm also gonna share with you my makeup inventory. So the last time I did a makeup inventory it was last year, September 2022 and now it's it's been a year. I, I didn't go on a no-buy but because I was so busy living my life in Spain because I went to Spain for a year I didn't really have a lot of time to keep up with the makeup and I also didn't have uh, enough interest for me to buy makeup so I think I only bought less than five items for the past year so I'm interested to see what my what my make my makeup inventory looks like now so first i have one primer last year september 2022 i had the same primer so in one year i was able to use up half of the product so i hope to use this up soon and my goal for primer is to have zero primer because i just don't see the difference but this is just uh, this is not a strict goal because sometimes my mood changes so my goal numbers can change but the essential thing is that I don't want my collection to be overwhelming so right now I'm glad to have this primer but I would also I also won't be sad if I don't have any primer so I have one primer next is the foundation last year i had seven and this year i still have the same exact foundation but last year this was full and i'm about to use this up and also this one i think i only have five uses left of this and um this one i'm almost halfway through this one i only have I think five more uses as well so it's the same number of products the same items exactly the same items but a lot of progress and some of them and I hope to finish these two together before uh, before the month ends so there and my goal for foundation is to have six but again that can change depending on my mood and my necessities but I think 6 to 10 foundations at the time, it's okay for me, but yeah. I'm happy with the amount of foundation that I have, but I would like to try some other brands. But before I buy other foundations, I want to use up some of them, so I'm happy with this one. Okay, so last year, I only had these three. And then these three, uh, my sister... I bought this from the States but my sister brought it to Spain around like earlier this year so these are the additional and um, my goal for concealer is 5 and that already includes the, co the highlighting concealers, the spot concealers and color correctors so I'm okay with this one. I definitely didn't have to buy two, two concealers from Glossier but all in all, I'm happy with this one and I'm also glad that I only have one um, liquid concealer uh, that's similar to my skin tone because the cautious one I heard goes bad uh, quickly. So it's nice to just have one so that I can focus on this one. But yeah, these are my concealers. And then setting powders. I have five. Last year, I had four and this one is the additional one because this one the same it's this, similar with the concealer with the concealers um i bought this before september last year but it only arrived earlier this year when i met my sister in spain so this one is the additional one and this is just the birthday gift from 20 2022 i think it's from sephora so this is the travel sized another travel sized um Laura Mercier setting powder which um, is about to yeah, I'm about to use this up too 
and i'm happy with this one this one i got in buy one get one sale so that's why i have two this one's our studio fix powder foundation but i use this as a setting powder and this one i bought this when it just launched and kind of wish i did it but it is what it is i bought it i'm just gonna try to use it up before i buy another one but this one i'm definitely gonna buy it the big the big um top of this one because i love the laura mercy one so there by the way by the way my goal for setting powder is five so i am within my my goal numbers and then moving on to the eyes i feel like this one is the most um boring part at least for me the eyebrows um and eyeliners and mascaras so i only have three mascaras this one is the only opened one which is the same opened one last year and uh, last year i had the same i had the same exact same mascaras and i i should i should get rid of this one it's just that i didn't really wear a lot of mascaras last year so i i didn't really use it but i ha uh yeah, I need to I need to get rid of this one. Maybe in a declutter video later on. But yeah, I have the same mascara and I don't mind having backups of mascara because these ones are either free or a gift with purchase. So I don't mind having backups of mascara. And I only open one mascara at a time, so I don't have any problems with mascaras. And my goal for mascara is just to have one one opened at a time. And then another boring category, at least in my opinion, are eyeshadows, or eyebrows rather. So I have, as you can see, five eyebrows. Last year I had two, and now I have um, five, and that's because I bought two more backups of the mix of the ColourPop brow pencil, but I don't really mind because I use up brow products a lot. And this one, the, the brow pomade, I bought this in 2018. So it's so old, but it still works. And I don't really use dip brows anymore, but this, I, I can use this while I'm just filming. Cause usually when I'm filming, um, my makeup is a little bit darker or a bit more bolder because you know, it's in the camera. And also I, I remove my makeup immediately so rather than waste my my favorite eyebrow products on for a few minutes I'll just use this one for filming so I have five let's go in with my with my eyeliners it's the same the same as last time I had I had five eyeliners last year and the same the same eyeliners this year. Um, I had LASIK surgery, that's why I didn't really wear a lot of eye makeup uh, last year. Um, so that's why it's almost unused. This one's our Marc Jacobs unopened, so I'm keeping this um, in a box because I don't want to open it and dry them. And then this one's are opened. Again, as much as I'd like to wear eyeliners, I couldn't from September last year to now because I just, I had my LASIK last year and then now I had my enhancement in LASIK. So I can't wear a lot of eye makeup as of now. So they remain the same. And my goal is uh, five. As so yeah, I'm within my, I'm within my number goal of four eyeliners. So my goal for single shadows is eight. And last year, I don't know exactly how much single shadows I have, but um, I think it's just uh, it's seven because this one is the additional this year since the last time I did my inventory. Oh, and this one, by the way, these two. So I think last year I had um, seven. And then these two are additional this year. So I have nine single shadows. And these two, um, this one... I'm almost out of it, so I can see this number going down even further. 
and once i use up uh, one or two of this i i want to buy some more like one and done shadows but for now i have nine shadows and my goal is eight so not bad okay so these are all of my eyeshadows very basic neutral 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 this is the only colorful shadow that I have. And then Viseart and another Natasha Denona. So I have eight palettes. And it's the same number of palettes as last year. And my goal for palettes is either 15 individual palettes or 100 pans in all of my palettes. So right now I have eight palettes and 53 pans right now i'm within my goal for eyeshadows but i don't know as soon as i can wear eyeshadow again i want to buy some more natasha denona I, i'm planning to buy at biba which has been on my list forever and the new i need a nude and as well as the dream palette to replace my colorful pal my colorful uh, shadows because this one I'm think of decluttering um, I think I'm past these colors so I don't know we will see but for now I have eight and I know they're all neutrals but it's what I wear so there and I love all of my shadows probably except this one but this one is old and as you can see it's been used so we'll see but for now I have Eight and fifty-three pants, so still within that twelve palette. I still so it's still within that fifteen palettes or one hundred pants. Okay, so next are cheek products. I have two highlighters. Last year, I had three highlighters. I used up my very old um, Becca Champagne Pop, so now I only have opal and lilac geode left and so uh, that's one less last year i had three this year i have two and my goal for highlighter is zero it's just i have oily skin and even during winter i still don't like the look of highlighter i have my natural oils and besides i prefer like a glowing blush or a cream blush rather than like sparkles on my face so and i just feel like it's it does not suit me highlighters so yeah i'm gonna try to use up some of these but my goal is zero and then bronzers bronzers I love bronzers this one I added this one uh, earlier this year because again I bought this in the States and it arrived to me earlier this year and for bronzers or contour I, I placed them both together my goal is six and last year I had four and now I have three I used up the other NARS um, Laguna bronzer that i used for traveling last year i use it's what i brought in all of my weekend travels from spain and i was able to use it up so i'm so happy with that and now i only have three i have one cream bronzer one like big bronzer that can also work as a contour and then one travel bronzer but my goal is six bronzers because I love bronzers. You can tell basing from my previous collections or from my previous um, categories, I only had like, you know, one digit of products per category. But obviously, you can tell I love blushes. I just love blushes <laughs> so last year i had 17 blushes and then 
uh, I the additional ones are the office hour and as well as this rose ink in camellia so I love I love I love my blushes especially those um, uh, rosy or dusky rose dusky rose or dusky pink colors because it just suits my olive skin tone so that's why i love you can see most of these are like natural tones or rosy beige and yeah i thought i'll be able i only brought like five blushes in spain for me to use for one year and i thought i'm gonna be able to use it up but no i didn't use up anything I was able to make a dent in some of them but no use up but i'm still happy with my collection i'm i'm not overwhelmed because i love all of these and i think i can declutter some before i leave for spain but for now i have 19 blushes last year i had 17 again i added these two and my goal for blushes is 15 so not really very far from my goal and i'm i'm trying to use all of my blushes while i'm in vacation so that before i leave again for spain this year before the month and i i am planning on decluttering some because i left them last year and then i don't feel like bringing them again this year so i might as well declutter them so these are my blushes. My favorite blush is the Satin Touch Blush in Satin Love from Essence. I love it so much that I bought a back up because they no longer sell this one. And yes, I prefer this like a $5 blush over my higher end blushes because I love the color. So there, that's my blush. Okay, the last category are lips. So I have six lip liners. Uh, this one is additional. Last year I only had this five. And this year I was gifted this one. So I have six. And my goal for lip liner is six. So it's still within the range. But I'd like to use up some of these and buy other colors because of it's all neutral and lip liner even though my goal is six i i don't mind getting over six because i'm in be because sometimes i like using lip liner so during those times i'd like to add more to my goals because i don't mind them because i like them but sometimes i can't be bothered with lip liners and during these times i decrease my goal number so it's it changes so for now, my goal is 6, but I won't be surprised if um, sooner or later that will change again to 10 to 10, to 10 or 15. So I don't mind having a lot of lip liners because I, I know I won't be overwhelmed enough for me to declutter some because it's easy for me to use up lip liners even though I wasn't able to use up any lip liner last year. But... If I really dedicate myself to using lip liners, it's easy for me to use up lip liners. And I like how my lips look like with lip liners. Sometimes I'm just too lazy to do it. But yeah, I have six. I'm happy with it. But I like to add more colors. Okay, lipstick. I'm not sure if they all fit in the frame but these are all of my lipsticks all of my lip stains my lipstick traditional lipsticks my blotted lips and my lip glosses or lip balms all of these are here so last year my go my lipstick collection was 23 now I have 24 so since these three new lipsticks that I just bought yesterday are already within the 24 and last year I had 23, that means I was able to use up two lipsticks last uh, from September 2022 to, to now. So I was able to, to use up completely the Eye Enchant from L'Oreal as well as um, the Sunny's Face uh, So Good. That one I didn't use up but I didn't really 
want to um, scrape most of the products, so I just decluttered it. So I have 24, and my goal for lipstick is 15. And that's because I noticed that I can do with just one or two lip balms. And for now, I have six lip balms. So once I use up most of this, I don't really intend to hoard a lot of lip balms. And I just need one or two reds. The rest can be nudes, different variations of nudes. And yeah, 15, 15 to 20 lipsticks for me, it's okay, it's enough. So for now, my lipstick goal is 15, but I won't be surprised if that goes to 20 because lipstick is hard to use up as well. So it's just easier to accumulate lipsticks or and blushes for that matter than using them up. And I'm not someone that likes to declutter stuff just because I want to stay within my number goal. So there. This one I'm about to use up. I was gonna declutter this one because I'm almost out of it, but I couldn't because it's still like a very beautiful blush color as well. And um, this one I'm about to use up as well. Hopefully within, before I leave again for Spain, I'll be able to use use this up so that, you know, it's less, less space in my makeup bag. This one I bought in Spain, Whirl, which I use only in winter because I find that it's too dark. Even in winter, it can be a bit too dark for me, but I just bought it and I couldn't bring myself to declutter it, even though I don't really, it's not my favorite. But sometimes I mix it with, the, with more reddish colors and it works, so there. I have these three, which I just bought. It's still in their boxes because I'm planning to bring all of these in Spain. I know it's gonna be crazy, but I bought all almost all of these in Spain, and even though I wasn't able to use up any, I'm about to use up like this one. All of these have the same amount of products, so I think I'll be able to use up a lot of lip balms next year. But yeah, these are my lipsticks. So now my current number is 103. And I can't really compare it to last year because last year again, I was counting the number of single palettes, single pants that I had rather than separating my single shadows and my palettes. So I can't really tell you how, how different it is from last year. But my goal right now is just 90 products and now i have 103 so it's more or less doable and again those number guides can change so that that overall 90 pieces of makeup can change to 100 but only until 100 i don't want to exceed more than 100 items in my collection because that would be too too big and considering i might be moving a lot um, I see myself moving a lot later on this year as well as next year. I don't want to be logging in a lot of makeup. So yeah, just less, 100 or less than uh, make. So, so yeah, just 90 to 100 items. It's okay for me. It's okay for me to exceed a little bit, but just not go over 100. And yeah, that's my collection. I hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.